testing, um, that test, we can either do both tests or, yes, we would just do the influenza test. But the intent wouldn't be that if we got a positive influenza but we were still concerned, the test wouldn't necessarily be sent off. That's a provider's decision. Is That, those are the specifics that we would like. Equipment is right here. I just. Yeah. 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 So I need to put I need to put the rapid crews up here. We set up that tent outside of our emergency department, um, as I described earlier, to enable us to be able to um, rapidly and efficiently and effectively take care of a number of patients who really don't need full treatment services in the emergency department, but rather need to be assessed by a healthcare provider and, if necessary, tested. And so that's what that tent is really there to serve, because we knew that we'd have, be having an influx of patients who um, only need that level of uh, care and that level of service. The other advantage to having the tent outdoors is that it helps with some of the infection control measures that are necessary with this coronavirus. So as the CDC has been recommending, uh, there's a necess there's necessity to have uh, 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 personal protective equipment uh, of a certain nature. There's a necessity to have patients who are suspected uh, in certain type of rooms, what we call isolation rooms. And those isolation rooms have ventilation that prevents recirculation of any airborne uh, pathogen. What I do is I screen everybody coming through our doors for COVID, um, for the um, actual uh, risk factors regarding COVID. If I determine by the CDC guidelines that they've established thus far, that they do uh, warrant a test, we will send them out to our tent outside. If um, they are still, if they have symptoms, but not ruling in for that, we'll send them on to registration. We've separated our waiting room into respiratory, a respiratory side and a non-respiratory side. This is all in an effort to keep the virus contained outside of our doors as much as possible. It, should anybody need emergent care, we would get them right into the back to be uh, treated right away without without a second thought from that, but we'd still maintain all our precautions. Excuse me. Because the biogen, that biogen conference, they were right next to it. Um, you, the biogen conference. Yeah.